my grandmother taught me about God. Mm. That's one of the greatest things she taught me, you know. She, my grandmother taught me about God and, and what was up and shit like that. So I knew early about God. I just ain't really had no relationship mm -hmm. until I really got in jail. And it wasn't even in jail because I used to run nuts in jail. I'm talking about, man, it's sad, but I had fun in that motherfucker. I mean, I had my fucked up moments and times too and shit. Like, I got back then and all that, you feel? <clears throat> Some busters rolled on me, you know? That's what, that's what happened when you banging in, that's what you doing. But I done rolled on hella motherfuckers and shit, so that shit all come with it. Get the motherfuckers back and keep all moving shit. So when they hit you though, like yeah, yeah, when you when you started getting closer to God, when did that hit you? Uh, like... Yeah, I don't know, probably in you know, 2010 or something. What happened? Yeah, ain't nothing happened. I was on lock all the time, you feel me? Mm. I stayed on lock. Now, they had me structured living, no cellmates, and I think I had made, I might have had like three cell, cellmates the whole time that I ever went on lock, because they they just treated me like an animal for real. Mm. So now I ain't had no books and shit for real, so I read the Bible and stuff like that. That's how that happened. Anything particular in the Bible that stuck out to you? Yeah, trust in the Lord with all your heart, laid out all your own understanding. It's Proverbs 3, 5. Mm -hmm. And that's because you don't be under, like, I only understand how I'm free right now, you feel me? I just I just had 28 years this time last year. Mm -hmm. You feel me? That's I how God works. 